Hey, hello everybody, let's learn more about our skeleton and bones in our whole body, in our uh, entire body or something like this, yes, let's learn it, I like it, and hello everybody, yes, uh, moving goings, oh my gosh, my camera, ah, okay, joints are the places where bones meet, different kinds of of joints allow you to move in different ways. Wow! Fixed joints. The bones that make up your skull start to join up soon after you are born. Once they have fused, none of them allow movement except the head jaw joint. Wow! It's uh, in the rest. It's called. It called. It is called. Uh, how to say it? Shwe. And uh, these joints is sustave, is thing like a da -da -da -da. hinge joint. Your knee can bend in the middle, but it can swing from side to side. This joint has a hinge like the one that allows you to open and close the door. Hinge, hinge. Ah, okay. Knee joint. Cool. Have you ever used a joystick? That's a ball and jo socket joint. Ah. Joystick, joint, that's a ball and socket joint, okay. There are, there are 19 movable joints in your hand, not counting the one in your wrist. Not counting the ones. Wow. Ball and sockets, your hips are ball and socket joints. They allow you to move your legs in all directions and even to turn them. Good. Bend the beats. Different sorts of joints all over your body keep you moving. Neck, bones, bones feature a pivot joint that allows your head to turn. Wrist have a joint that allows them to turn but not to go right round. Ankles contain different joints for up and down and side to side movement. Moving joints. Your hand is a terrific feat of the engineering. Tape your thumb to your f first thingy. See how difficult it is to open a notebook, pick up a pen and to write your name. It's easy. Wow, but our fingers is so... Oh my gosh, this looks pretty. Super. Hip hooray. Joints, particularly knee and hip joints, something we're out of old... We're out in old age. When this happens, the doctors can remove their worn-out joint and replace it with an artificial one. Artificial... Ah, transplanted. Hip hooray. Thank you, thumbs. Your thumb is the most flexible of your finger. You rely on your thumbs whenever you handle delicate objects. This woman has stretchy muscles and lig ligaments that allow allow her spine to bend further than most people can manage. Okay, ligaments, bands of tissue called ligaments act like elastic. They hold your bones together yet still allow to move. Ligament bone, fabulously flexible. People whose joints are particularly flexible are called double jointed. The condition can run in families, but people who are double jointed must practice if they want to keep their ligaments stretchy. Stretchy. Ah, must practice. Okay. Your elbows have a hingle joint for bending and pivot joint so they can turn. Ligament. Wow. Ligament bone. The body's muscles. Ooh. Yeah. Pulling strength. About six, 650 of your muscles are wrapped around the bones of your skeleton. They move your body by pulling on the bones. Together they form the muscle system. The, brecto the brectalis muscle swing your arm. Pectoralis. Pectoralis. The bicep muscles bend your arm. Pectoralis. What is pectoralis? Is uh, some of the chest. Pectoralis. 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 Oh, yes. Every time you move, you use muscles. Muscles make you walk, blink and smile. Some muscles work without you thinking about them. But others need to be told to move. They all work by shrinking, which makes them pull off or squeeze. 
Your longest muscle is the sarotius. It helps cross your legs. The tibialis muscle bend your foot. Okay. Smooth muscle. This type of ah, uh, this type of muscle makes thing move inside your body. It mixes food in your stomach and pushes food through your in inten. Wow, a really interesting. Smooth muscle cells are short with pointed ends. Hard muscles. When you put your hand on your chest, you can feel your heart beating. Your heart is a strong muscle that squeezes blood around your body. Hard muscle cells are strippy with oval blobs. Blobs. Oval blobs. Skeletal muscle. Skeletal muscles pull on bones to change the shape of your skeleton and move your body. Change the shape of your skeleton and move your body. These muscles are voluntary, which means you can use them to control them. Skeletal muscle cells are long and thread-like. What weight more? All your bones on are all your. I think all your. Huh? Interesting. All your bones, maybe, but maybe it's... no. N it doesn't same. It's not same. Muscles magic. Muscles have hundreds of uses. They make up about a third of your body weight. Wow. Largest muscles. You see the muscles in your body for sitting and walking. Fastest muscles. This one makes you blink. It works up to five times a second. Okay. Cool. Ear wiggling. A few people can control the muscles around this, the ears. A few control. Ah, I can. Smile. A fake smile uses different muscles from a real involuntary smile. Who's in charge? Use hundreds of muscles when you run a jump. Your brain controls them all. A bit like a conductor controlling an orchestra. It sends signals along nerves to every muscle saying exactly when to work and when to rest. Okay, hundreds of muscles work in a carefully controlled sequence when you jump in the air. Jumping in the air. Oh, Jesus, so funny. I don't know who, who are, who, who, who did created. Who are created? How to say it? Who are created? Who have created? Who has created it? Tongue twister. Your tongue is a bundle of lots of muscle that make it super flexible. It can reach in anywhere in your mouth to pull and push bits of food. Its acrobatic movement are also vital to speech. Your tongue contains at least 14 different muscles that makes it amazing flexible. How muscle works? Muscle work by contrast, con contracting, which means they shorten. As a muscle contracts, it pulls. The larger the muscle, the more powerfully it pulls. The larger the muscle, the more powerfully it pulls. When the bicep muscle contracts, it pulls your forearm and bends your arm. When the tricep muscle contracts, it straightens your arm. Contracts, I think, is sacrifices. Contract, yeah, zumat sacrifices in there. Working in pairs, muscles can pull but not push. They work in pairs that pull in opposite directions. When one muscle pulls, its partner relaxes. Your forearms contain pairs of muscles that move your hand and fingers back and forth. Back and forth. Fibers and in fibers. Skeletal muscles are made of cells called muscle fibers. Inside this are even finer fibers called myofibrils, which contracts to make a muscle shorten. A typical muscle bundle of muscle cells, one muscle cell, myofibrils, myofibrils inside of muscle cell. Where is the body's smallest muscle? Hmm. I think the... the your muscle. Where is the body's smallest body? A muscle. 
I think I think in the thing in uh, fingers fingers or inside of our ear okay <laughs> try raising your ring finger with your hand in this in this position it's stuck because it's joined to the same tandem at the middle finger oh easy but not fully tendons muscles are fastened to bones by tooth tooth bands called tendons when you wiggle your fingers you can see the tendons move on the back on your hand tendons move okay tandem something interesting tandem tendon ah it's making faces muscles in your face are attached to skin as well as bone in your face attached to skin as well as bone they pull the skin when you change your expression you use about 17 muscles when you smile a floppy start no rest muscles work all the time they hold you upright without them you would flop on the floor muscles also work when you are asleep keeping your body firm and toned a floppy start a newborn baby has little control over his head or neck muscles it takes about a month before it can hold up its hand head and six months for strong steady head control getting a stitch if you run a lot you may get a pain in your side this is a stitch signs aren't sure exactly why it happens but it might be because the muscles and ligaments in your abdomen are working too hard okay moving muscles stamina if you have stamina you can keep going for a long time without in the ear yeah i was right by the way it was where the bottom smallest muscles if you have stamina you can keep going for a long time without getting tired he said that make uh, so you feel out of breath like running improves your stamina out of breath okay muscles power the more you use your muscle the better they get active games and exercise make your muscle larger stronger and more flexible they also help you keep going without tiring flexibility when you are flexible your joints and muscles can move freely and your body can bend and straighten easily exercise that stretches your body such as gymnastic and dancing improves your flexibility can move freely okay this country contra Chinese has made your body more flexible by doing exercises that stretch your back okay string pushing pulling and lifting make your muscles bigger and stronger bodybuilders lift heavy weights over and over again until their muscles are enormous you need strong muscles to win a tug of war of war tug of war in the rush maybe tug of war yeah tug of war tug of war tug of war what happens to muscles if you don't exercise they will be weak and and uh, and not and not flexible let's learn muscle food ways to keep fit exercise is very good for your health as well as making your muscle bigger it strengthens your heart and lungs walking to school or going out for walks builds strength and stamina football is a great is great for improving your flexibility and strength swimming strengthens then strengthens your heart muscles and builds stamina it's great for improving your flexibility and strength to school or going build strength and stamina cycling strengthen your leg muscles and builds up stamina dancing keep your body supple and helps build strength supple what is supple 
supple, moving easily and gracefully. Muscle food. To build strong muscles, you need a type of food called protein. Meat, fish, beans, milk and eggs are rich in protein. Most vegetables don't contain much protein. Milk, chicken, fish, egg, beans, fish is a very good source of protein. Body heat. This picture shows the heat of a man's body. Muscles make heat when they work hard. Which is why exercise makes you hot. On cold days, your muscles try to warm you up by shivering. Wow! Shivering. <gasps> okay, I understand. Wow. They get small and weak. Yes, correct. It's about muscles. What happens to muscles if you don't exercise? Headquarters. Quarters. The brain is the body control center. It is a complicated organ that works very quickly, a bit like a brilliant living computer. Since signals, the cerebrum is the main part of your brain. It gets and stores sense information and also controls your movements. Cerebrum. Cerebrum, what is Cerebrum. Cerebrum. Cerebellum. Cerebellum is mozhichok. Yes. Cerebellum. Cerebellum. Brainstem. Clever calculator. The cerebrum is also responsible for thinking and speaking and complicated tasks such as sums. <clears throat> Your brainstem works at the same rate whether you awake or sleep. Brainstem. Also, you do the brain stem makes sure your heart and breathing never stop. What is brain stem? The central trunk of the mammal's brain. Okay, muscle control. Your cerebellum helps you to balance and move your muscles. You use this bit of your brain when you dance. Does your brain hurt when you have a headache? I think yes. <gasps> no. He works ha hard, maybe. It's one of the reasons. In relation shapes to, s in relation to the size of your bodies, humans have the biggest brain of any animal. Brain box. Your skull is a bunny shell that fits together like a jigsaw around your brain. Shock absorbing liquid fills the space between the brain and skull. Okay, brain box. Curiosity quiz. Take a look through your brain and scissors pages and see if you can spot where they f are from. Is uh, heat, heat visualizing, is blood, is nervous system, I don't know, is brain, it's uh, agar ear, it's one more. Learning. When you learn to do something, you create connection between cells in your brain. Next time you do it, the connection are already there, so to use a short-term memory. Okay. Your short memory only holds information for about a minute. You use it to compare prices when you go shopping or to remember a name when you meet someone new. Your name, phone numbers you know by heart and skills such as riding a bike can be kept for many years in your long-term memory. No, your brain can can't feel pain, but the muscles around your head can okay, we will continue in the next time with network of nervous and thanks so much for everybody who was watching. It was our human body. we was talking about our brain else about our muscles. <coughs> that we have in our brain cerebrum is our main place to do some of the clever calculations cerebellum for balancing brain stem for 24 uh, an hour uh, 24 hour a day dealing about food about muscle power flexibility and uh, inside of my brie my brills me brills cool i think it's 
interesting okay we will learn it in the next time more thank you so much for watching see ya bye bye yeah <laughs> cool be cool